Let's say we double on the post player here. Give me the ball, please. I'm the post player, okay? And let's say that from, from a scouting standpoint, we're on defense now. You get down there. You're out there, okay? You're going to deny the pass out to the strong side, right? And we'll double, we'll double sometimes guard to big. Now, we don't like to do this because big guys can throw through the guards a lot of times. But if he does a good job and climbs up my pivot leg and gets his hands in my thing, in my plane, then it's tough for me to do that. But watch what happens now. Let's say I throw the ball back out. To stay there. You're in a double team. Throw the ball back. When he double guard to big, you're going to rotate up and play the ball. You're going to X out. You X out to the weak side of the floor, to the guard that, that he's left. Okay, you're going to X out. So whenever we double guard to big, we X out. The guard who doubles is going to X out to the weak side of the floor to play that guy. Every time we double big to big, come on over and double me big to big. As soon as I turn away, the guy who was originally playing, again, the reason we do this is because this guy's momentum, when he's coming over, his momentum is going forward. We don't want to force him to have to turn around and go back and play that guy under the basket. So when he comes over and forces me, and they force me to turn away, you're going to drop back and play the, the, the basket, and you're going to play me one-on-one -on -one in the post. So whenever we double big to big, the guy who doubles stays. The guy who was originally playing the big drops back into the lane to cover the basket or to cover the offensive player who's cutting to the basket. 